While you were cursing your Game of Thrones heartache habit, you probably missed solar-powered flight, fun with CGI celebs, and holographic gaming. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where the stories are as fresh as the sweat on a public VR headset. Let's take our experience off the wall and then put it on the table over here. You'd need a whole new setup to broadcast this Minecraft session to Twitch. Microsoft demoed this VR version of the game at E3, where presenters use the HoloLens headset to play the game on a wall, transfer it to a tabletop, and manipulate it in 3D. The game reacts to voice commands and lets players direct gaming by looking. Still no word if Microsoft will partner with IKEA to bundle everyone's favorite side table with each HoloLens. It's a very difficult bill to pass because there's a lot of moving parts. CGI modeling just got a whole lot easier thanks to a breakthrough from the University of Washington. What used to take hours mapping an actor's features was built using paparazzi photos and face tracking software. Researchers basically managed what South Park did with Mel Gibson. I just sure hope you don't use those whips over there on the wall. Side bonus, see what it looks like when all the politicians say all the same thing. Oh right, you've totally already seen that. Oh my God! The Solar Impulse 2 is about to take on flight over the Pacific Ocean. If successful, it will set all kinds of records and will take a pilot four or five days and nights in just one go. Speaking of going, the toilet is under the pilot's seat. The plane has solar panels similar to the ones found on houses and stores backup energy for nighttime flight in lithium batteries. And now you're all caught up. See you tomorrow.